Hello. <laughs> so, welcome to my... 10 things you didn't know about Dima Ume. Hello, this is Welcome back to another exciting video and thanks for watching. In this video, we shall be shining the light on one of the most prominent beauty and lifestyle vloggers in Africa, Dima Ume. If you're a beauty and lifestyle enthusiast, you probably must have heard or come across this very popular African content creator, either on YouTube or Instagram. Chedima Ume, popularly known as Dima Ume, or that Igbo chick, is a Nigerian beauty and lifestyle influencer and content creator. She was born on the 5th of June 1990 in Enugu, where she grew up with her parents and six siblings. She studied banking and finance at the University of Nigeria Enugu campus, where she obtained her degree. She later moved to the UK for her master's degree at the later part of 2011 and the beginning of 2012. She started her blog where she shared her makeup looks and beauty tips. Due to popular demand, she started a YouTube channel where she shared her makeup tutorials. Fast forward to 2020, she has grown to be one of the most popular and influential beauty gurus in Africa. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn notifications so you do not miss any of our videos. Dimma has been grinding on YouTube for close to 8 years. As of the time of the making of this video, she currently has 339,000 subscribers with over 260 uploads. So, let's take a closer look at this amazing content creator with the 10 things you didn't know about Dimma Ume. Number 1. She did not go to makeup school. Shocking, right? Looking at how awesome her makeup looks and how detailed her makeup tutorials are, you would think she attended a fancy makeup school. Well, that is not the case. She learned how to do makeup by simply watching makeup tutorials on YouTube and with constant trial and errors, she perfected her craft. Due to her passion for makeup, she invested time and money into her passion and with consistency, she has grown into one of the best makeup artists in Africa. Today, hundreds and thousands of makeup enthusiasts click on her makeup tutorial videos to learn. Talk of the power of YouTube. Number 2. Her parents never wanted her to be a content creator on YouTube. Just like most African parents, Dima's parents never wanted her to be a YouTube content creator. They had wished she chose a more conventional career path like becoming a lawyer, a doctor or even a banker. Well, she rolled with that for a while and had a degree in banking and finance and a master's degree in entrepreneurship and innovation. After graduation, she had to persuade her parents to let her follow her passion which was content creation. After convincing her parents, she relocated to Lagos where it all started. We are pretty sure her parents are proud of her achievements now. Number 3. Her most popular video has over 2.2 million views. Starting and growing the channel on YouTube is very difficult and even more so when you are venturing into a niche that is very competitive. Fortunately for Dimma, she started her YouTube channel at a time when YouTube was fairly new to Africans. Though she struggled at the beginning due to high competition from the West, she later on found her voice and audience. At the time she started, her channel was called That Igbo Chick and the video started accumulating hundreds and thousands of views by 2014. As of the time of making this video, her most viewed video titled Makeup Do's and Don'ts, Beginners Friendly has over 2.2 million views with thousands of comments. Over the years, Dima has managed to build a loyal following despite the massive increase in awesome creators from Africa. She also has several videos with more than 500,000 views. Number 4. She makes approximately $10 to $20,000 on YouTube every year. Content creation can be hard, but the rewards are outstanding. Talk of fame and money. We all know YouTube pays content creators. Well, if you didn't know, now you know. When you upload videos on YouTube and people watch those videos, YouTube pays the creator of those videos. Now looking at the amount of views Dima gets on her videos, she makes between $10,000 to $20,000 on AdSense per year, according to Social Blade which is very impressive, considering some university lecturers in Nigeria don't even come close. Apart from AdSense revenue, she advertises for brands which also fetches her some money. Number 5. Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie is her role model. Aside creating content on YouTube, Dima Ume loves reading and particularly African literature and some of her favorite books are written by Nigerian author Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie. On several occasions, Dima has professed her love and admiration for Chimamanda. Some of her popular books include Half of a Yellow Sun, Americana and Purple Hibiscus. 
Demi's love for Chimamanda has made her buy several copies of some of her books. Last year, her dream came true when she met with the author at an event in Lagos, Nigeria and even had a signed copy of one of her books. Surprisingly, Chimamanda confessed to have bought a lot of makeup she never needed due to Dinma's amazing YouTube videos. Dear Displorers, we have dedicated a video on 10 things you didn't know about Chimamanda Ngozi Adichie. Click on the card on your screen to check it out. Number 6. She's extremely good with interior designing. Since the beginning of her YouTube career, Dima has always shown her interest in interior designing and on several occasions, she has declared she would venture into interior designing at some point in her life. Her savoir faire when it comes to interior designing can be seen in her YouTube videos. Her space is always neatly and nicely put together and her house door video got everyone talking. Not because the house was a mansion, but because it was aesthetically very pleasing. She puts a lot of thought into her space and her creativity shines through. She will sure have a successful business if she ever ventures into interior designing. Number 7. She does a lot of giveaways on her channel. Dima is one of the most successful beauty vloggers in Africa and with a huge fan base she constantly receives a lot of PR packages from brands and most times what she does is give away these products to her subscribers. Most of her giveaways are mostly makeup and beauty products since most of her subscribers are female. So if you want a chance to receive free makeup and beauty products, subscribe to her channel and watch her videos for the next giveaway. Number 8. She struggles with depression every now and then. Now most of you might be shocked hearing this because she comes across a very jovial and happy person but a lot goes on behind the scenes. Content creation can be very exhausting and particularly creating on YouTube where subscribers are constantly asking for more. It can get really depressing. Depression and mental health is still a no-go topic in Africa but truth is a lot of Africans are actually depressed especially content creators and that is simply because creativity is mentally exhausting. Constantly worried about what topic to create on, views, subscribers, and overgrowth can get the better part of us. However, in Dima's case, it's more than that. She struggles a lot with depression which makes her to take breaks from social media every now and then. So don't be surprised if her uploads are not consistent. Number 9. She no longer does makeup for pay. At the beginning of Dima's YouTube career, she published a lot of makeup tutorials which made her very popular and highly solicited. She would do makeup for several clients and would get paid for her services. Later on, she started having issues with clients who wouldn't pay on time and coupled with the fact that her YouTube career was really picking up, she needed to focus and not be distracted. As of now, she no longer considers herself as a makeup artist. Number 10. She is one of the most traveled Nigerian-based YouTubers. As we already mentioned, Dima is one of the most successful African-based content creators and as a result, she travels a lot for work. She was born in Nigeria, but as of 2020, she has traveled more than 5 countries. She first traveled out of Nigeria when she went to do her master's degree in the UK. In 2013, she traveled to the USA. She has also been to France, Italy, Kenya and has been to some of these countries more than once. Amongst all the countries she has visited, her favorite city is New York City in the US, followed by Lagos. There you have it, the explorers. Those were the top 10 things you didn't know about Dimma Ume. And as a little compensation for watching this video up to this point, here is an extra bonus fact. Number 11. She is the first child in a family of 9. The 30-year-old content creator from Enugu is the first of 7 children from her Anambra father and Imo mother. Though very little is known of her other siblings, one of her sisters called Norma is mostly in her vlogs. There is a lot of pressure and responsibilities that comes along with being a first child, and the pressures become worse if you are a female. Dimma Ume is one content creator from Africa you should be watching because she is changing the narrative of being a certain country in order to follow and achieve your dreams. With her consistency and passion, the future is bright for this amazing African content creator and we wish her all the best. Thanks for watching this video. Which other African content creator would you like us to profile next? Leave your suggestions in the comments and we will do well to grant your request. Also, if you did enjoy this video, do well to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. I hope that this video was helpful, especially for those of you who requested it. Don't forget to thumbs it up if you liked it and subscribe if you're new here. I love you guys and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.